All right, hello everyone, and we're gonna be looking at this here All Pro fluorescent security light. Um, as you see there in the box, it's been opened up and used before. Just got this a couple weeks ago. Um, not too long ago, I didn't get it. Want to read anything on there? You can pause and read it, and it's included the bulb. And I have an extra bulb. Now I'm actually really impressed with the quality of this fixture. It is actually very good quality. So. That's kind of nice if you're going to use it, but this light is going to get mounted up there where that one is. So, we'll go ahead and open it up. On the extension, we got some instructions. Right here, we've got um, the shade protector, or whatever you want to call it. This lens is actually really good quality. Very good this is a very nice lens. Very nice. And here we got the bulb. 65 watt bulb. Comes along with it. It is not as bright as the 175 watt mercury vapor, but we're just putting it up because it will save us power there. And that one might get put up somewhere else or put in this box. I don't really want to take it down. In here, the light is actually very simple. It just has a little box in there with all the important parts in it. Here on the front of the fixture is our photo socket. Cooper lighting information. And all these warnings makes it look kind of bad. The only thing I don't like is, is that those two holes there, they are not threaded. So I'll have to put in actual bolts to do it. Compared to any other fixture, I believe the ones are threaded. Actually, they aren't on lots of these lights I got here. So, um, it... It'll be all right, I think. I don't know if I can make a bolt go in there. The light is not heavy at all. But in there, Cooper lighting. Solutions. Fluorescent, the mogul size socket. So you could screw 175 watt mercury vapor in. I do not recommend it. I actually am not even going to. And there you have some information. Over here is some more information. There's all the information inside of there. But yeah, like I say, the lens on this is way thicker than on some of my mercury vapors. Now, this isn't sun faded or anything yet, but it should stay like that. And up there we got the 175 watt mercury vapor that this will be replacing. I don't want to replace it, but it was mounted on the pole down like right there, a little lower. By where that shiny thing is on the pole, that's where it was. So, we're going to go ahead and take a look at the bulb. Just says 65 watt, 6400K. It's about the same as mercury vapor. I will not be starting this fixture for you guys. It does work. Because I have to get up there and install it and the phone battery is running low. In the box, it comes included with these screws, which I recommended to mount it on the pole. Which is kind of nice, but I won't be using those properly. So, like I say, the only thing I don't like about it is these are not threaded. 
those two are though maybe i could put it across there instead i don't know i'll figure it out um i gotta get the old one down so that'll be it for this video thank you for watching and have a good day